Bop! Howdy hey, this is Frackbox, and I'm here with uh, True Blue Blur. Or, Long time no see. Or should I say, Batman? <laughs> so, uh, yeah, so uh, we're playing Batman Arkham Asylum. Go to the cloud save games. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah. Um, Batman Arkham Asylum. Let's see, which, which Batman so, so, should we Shall we choose? start new game? Start new game, start new game, or start new game? Um, I'm kind of... Well, there's there's a couple of different Batmans to choose from. Yes, there are. There's Serious Batman. Yes. There's uh, Looking Down Batman. Mm -hmm. There's Cheeky Batman. And then there's... Um, I'm trying to think of some meme, but nothing is... That bird? Could, huh? Makes me think of a bird. It does kind of look like a bird, almost. <laughs> um, I'm feeling more Cheeky Batman today. Okay. Let's go Cheeky Batman. Cheeky Batman to go with the peck shot. <laughs> oh, that's right. <laughs> totally didn't see. So, Oh, turn up the brightness all the way. It'll just look better in the recording. So, okay. Uh, turn off no. subtitles, of course, because we're going to be talking. Yeah, we, we need to be able to read what's being said. <laughs> yeah. Uh, and we don't have 3D glasses. Uh, I mean, we could turn it on for the folks at home. No, I'm joking. I don't no, think no, no, no. we. I don't think we want that. Uh, yeah, no, because that that'll. <laughs> it, it would murder our eyeballs. It would. Yeah. Uh, enemies are tougher and have better awareness. No, of... no. <laughs> I'm not even gonna bother with any of that. Okay. I mean, we are playing <laughs> just for the story anyway. Right? Yeah. Yeah. Um. So I hear to talk about a different franchise. <laughs> um. There's going to be another episode of Game of Thrones this weekend. Oh yeah. It's not one that I have started yet, so. Yeah, because I saw the the first episode of season, I think it's eight, isn't it? The latest one? It is one? eight, yeah. Um, it was too short. <laughs> and uh, by this time, enough people have seen it to where it's probably not a spoiler, but it was a very, it was almost kind of a happy episode. Oh, yeah. Well, it's like a spoiler for me. I did just say that I haven't started watching oh, it. Oh, I, sorry. <laughs> I, I apologize. It's, um... Which is really the only reason I bring that up, I, you know, because I do plan on watching it, but I just have so many things on my list I haven't gotten to it. Yeah, it's kind of a shorter episode. Um, yeah. Yeah. So I, I'd recommend maybe waiting until this next episode comes out so you can binge watch it. Yeah. Because <laughs> um, it's it's this episode feels like the the thing the calm before the storm almost. Oh so, yeah, for sure. Um, I mean, stuff happens in it, so even that's not really like a. Like too much of a spoiler, to be perfectly honest. There's a there's stuff that happens in it, but it just feels like, you know, yeah. stuff's gonna go down. So, um, but by the time this airs, you'll probably have. No, probably not. Oh, really? <laughs> I'm I'm in the middle of watching a couple of other shows that are kind of long, so it's probably gonna be a bit. Gotcha. So, um, just to recap the story for you, um, like all the story you really need. Uh, in Game of Thrones? In, in Batman. Okay, I was going to be like, no, no, I haven't watched any of it. <laughs> it all starts off, this guy, uh, Eddard Stark. <laughs> he, uh, he's, he's super cool, and everybody likes him. Sigh. And uh, <laughs> so, yeah, so Batman captured the Joker here, as you can plainly see. Yep. Um, who is that that voices that character, Warden Sharp? He sounds, I, I don't know. He sounds so familiar. So this guy Frank should be an actor. <laughs> Apparently. Yeah. Because I do. I don't remember much about this game, but I do remember that he is maybe not what he seems. Is you know a, a little bit uh, different than you expect. Mm -hmm. Going with him. Something's not right. Wow. Sure is. Uh, I forgot how 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 little anti-aliasing there was on the Xbox 360. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. Yeah, I'm sure like the YouTube compression will probably like to, it. to an extent. Yeah. Yeah, but it's almost like it's almost like looking at like something on my phone, like playing a game off my phone or something. I think the Xbox 360 it only has like 512 uh, 512 megabytes of RAM. I think. Oh yeah. Yeah, because most of the uh, of just general RAM, because um, I think it, it does have some other RAM, but I think it's tied to the video card or something. Huh, interesting. Oh no, no, it's just that. No, okay, I'm wrong. So it has the five. <laughs> it has the five twelve megabytes of RAM. Okay, but it controls more of how it disperses that for you. 
and so it makes the job for uh, like developers really easy because it, it it decides how it's going to use the RAM kind of on the fly. Yeah. Um, so, because generally if you have a video card, the video card would have its own RAM, uh, VRAM, basically. And uh, I think the Xbox 360 was different in that way. Interesting. Which is another reason why the Xbox 360 was more popular than the PlayStation 4. Not only did the, play the Xbox 360 come out sooner, but um, it was also easier to develop for. Gotcha. Which is why there were more indie games for it. So, okay. Um, it was less expensive, easier to develop for. It really was the poor man's console, but that <laughs> yeah. really worked in its favor. How does he know? What's up, Doc? Cancel me in for tomorrow at four. Because he knows that... Uh, hey, I, I, he's, he's just aware of the schedule, I'm pretty sure. Because he was... Because um, we were doing a sound test before this. And there's yeah. stuff that I wasn't really paying attention to while... Because I was doing all the, the sound whatever. Oh, right, yeah. And now that I'm listening to his actual, like, spiel here... Uh -huh. He does know a lot of stuff, but yeah. you've got to keep in mind that, you know, he's been in and out of here many times. Yeah. So he's probably just really familiar with the, the schedules and such. Yeah. The state of the wiring in these federal facilities is well, it's shocking. My boys is there any reason why Batman keeps sending people here? Um, because it is, um... Check your prisoner, Officer Bolt intended for the criminally insane specifically yeah because i mean it's also supposed to be a rehabilitation center because because think about it right so he keeps breaking out of here uh-huh and so so like the the common denominator is is this this location and so if he keeps breaking out of here Get the door open. Why not just take him to another place? Well, the problem with that is um, he can get out of it by using the, the insanity plea and has done so. Oh. Well, I mean, there's... I mean, I'm sure there's there's other in, insane asylums, right? Um, I don't have any idea. I don't know enough about the universe. What if this, your gun is clipping through my camera? <laughs> Uh, Must have been one of the guys. No, this is probably the only insane asylum in the entirety of the DC universe. <laughs> this seems to be where everybody goes. Who's, who's got? Uh, well, at least all of Batman's enemies. Yeah. Keep your trained on it. So this seems to be more than just an insane asylum. Uh, yeah, you know, I, th I think it's also like super high security, supposedly. You know, it's interesting. What's it doing? What's keeping him from? I've got your scent back. Because I mean, the gun, the guns aren't really going to do very much. Um, oh, he's probably got a shot collar. Okay, yeah, he does. Yeah. yeah. I, I, I don't know how bulletproof he is, but you know. Don't stop me from killing you, Batman. So, because he kind of looks like the type who, like, a shot collar wouldn't really. I mean, it, it might be annoying, but. I wonder who controls the shot collar. I really need to get me some new shoes. Okay, move up. Is it somebody like in the same room as him? I think it probably was one of these guys who who turned it on. Next, I mean, all he would need to do is just kill the person who's holding the shot collar, and then he'd be good. <laughs> yeah. So, I mean, I don't know. I'm sure it will come up later. I'm sure that we're gonna fight him later. Right? We are gonna fight him, okay. yes. No, I'm just gonna assume that everything's gonna go well. You right. Um, the Joker's not gonna escape. We're just gonna escort him to a cell. Wow, his face is really distorted. Yep, it is. Just like. Oh, Frankie, you really should. It's not even like the shape of his face, of is, like necessarily, but like just his get you when his mouth trouble. opens. He he Tell has a very something. long. You've mouth. never let me catch yep, this season. He does. What are you really after? Well, nothing much. Hundreds dying in pain and fear. All their meaningless lives brought to a horrifying conclusion. All thanks to you and a book of matches. Oh. Was that the answer you wanted? All patients should avoid calling There was a, uh, uh, a, an image that I saw shared on Facebook uh, the other day. 
<laughs> showed like a uh, Joker saying something to the effect of uh, uh, like I'll mess with Batman. But I won't mess with the, the IRS. IRS. The IRS. I'm not that yeah. crazy. Yeah, I've seen that. I think it was from uh, the animated series. Oh, that's hilarious. Don't you trust me? Our guest has arrived. Hmm. Well, those those arm braces look pretty easy to break out of, to be honest. It depends on what they're made out of. Well, I mean, he all he needs to do is oh, just slide. they are they are fairly big, because he needs like, to just slide his arm up and then he's yeah. out. It depends on how well they actually like adjusted them. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I don't even think he's gonna bother doing that though. Yeah. Long night, Jim. I'm pretty sure it'd be Whoa, super. Shit. Jim Gordon. Jim is swole. I. It's true. He's really buff in this version. Why is he so buff? I, because it's comic books. I don't know. <laughs> Everybody needs to be buff. Right. Sorry, Batman. Arkham staff only. What I what I think is really funny with those arm braces is that like it'd be super easy for him to get out of them, considering the fact that he keeps clipping through them. Oh. <laughs> You know what, you're right. <laughs> Why did they... Okay, so with the Joker, right? Uh-huh. I would not give him the ability to walk. Yeah. any of this. I know it. Uh, that, I, I, I don't know why they didn't keep him in that thing. Oh, here we go. And why... Shouldn't... Okay. The other guy out there is just a doctor. Right, but when you handcuff someone, you handcuff them around their back. Yeah. You don't you don't handcuff them in their front cuz exactly that thing happens. Yeah. Like it's literally incompetence to handcuff them in the front. <laughs> that's, just, that's just something you, you don't do. Oh, that was super easy for him to escape. Yeah, he he was very prepared for this. I mean, I'm sure if he didn't break out there, he, he would have bro broken out some other way. Yes. You know, what's, what's interesting? <laughs> the ragdoll physics. I know it. Um, oh! Slow-mo. Whoa, he's dead. No, Batman doesn't kill? I mean, he's not moving. Look at his spine. Look at the other guy's spine. Oh, but but wait, wait. No, no, I forget that the thing is inverted. Oh yeah, because I you can you can turn it off inverted controls if you want. I'm, oh hi. I'm pretty sure he's breathing if you check like the movement of his belly. Oh really? Yeah. Do you, do you need to turn it off inverted? I will uh, finish this fight. Okay. Finish the fight. It's Halo 3. I'll finish the fight. <laughs> Keeping combos going in this game is silly and super easy. Whoa, he just like zoomed across the universe. Yep, as long as you have a combo going, he'll go to the nearest guy. You just have to pick the direction on your, your joystick and then make sure you're aiming sort of where the dude is. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Try and uh, are you going to turn it to... Know what's happened. Yeah. Okay. So, uh, 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 let's see. While you're doing that, I think it's it's invert look. Yeah. Yeah. There you go. Um, so... That's better. For the rest of the episode, do you want to talk about your week? Um, I mean, sure. It, it, there wasn't much of one. <laughs> oh, just work? Yeah, pretty much. Work both at home and at work. Gotcha. That's often the case. <laughs> yeah. We got a Riddler trophy. I did got a Riddler trophy. Oh, nice. Um, yeah, my, my week has basically just been um, job searching. Yeah. And uh, anything else? I've been experimenting a lot with streaming. Yeah. So Bryce and I did some streaming. Uh, yeah. That's that's kind of been it, just job searching and and streaming and kind of kind of feels like my time's just been wasted, to be honest. Um, I I understand. Uh, it would be nice to just like work uh, a good job, um, 
you know, get, get that 40 hours a week. Because um, I'm kind of a productive Everywhere person. Yeah. Goes. And so for me to just be sitting, basically doing a whole lot of nothing, um, except for just sitting on a computer job searching, because that's what I've been doing with most of my time. Um, and I take breaks every now and then, but... Uh, plus, I'm, I'm not spending a whole lot of money. Yeah. Because um, I you know, don't have a job right now, so... I'm doing a pretty good job at that. I have more money right now than I thought I'd have. Yeah. So... I rewarded myself a little bit and bought some uh, some soda. <laughs> nice. Um, but I've been drinking basically mostly water. Yeah. Because so. uh, I'm on the keto diet, so I drink like a zero calorie soda. It's like, oh, oh, whoa, okay. Yeah, that was weird camera stuff. Hi, dude. You're lucky to be alive. <laughs> oh, cool. Uh, okay, uh, I'll, I'll worry about this door while you worry about keeping me alive. Okay. Can you hear me? I'm with Batman. Hello? Where are they? It is nice to see you need help? them no, like like alone. like the police working with Batman. Yeah. Instead of the whole like you know, Batman's you a menace to society sort of thing. <laughs> right. Yeah, um it it just kind of depends on what time frame the stuff is happening in cuz this game is taking place pretty far along into Batman's career. Uh, career yeah. yeah. Cause it, I went the wrong way. Because, you know, if if a Batman were to exist, right? I mean... Well, in, there is stuff like that. Like, um, Seattle in particular, or no, it's, it's Washington in general, um, has some laws in place that allow for certain types of vigilantism. And Seattle has a superhero um, with all kinds of gadgets and stuff who is an MMA fighter. Oh, really? Who works with the police and everything. Yeah, he does citizen's arrests and all of that kind of stuff. Wow, because I know that Beaverton... I don't remember a, his name. Beaverton had a superhero for a bit. Yeah. Um, he had, like, a shield or something. Oh, yeah. Um, he was more like a glorified, like, night watchman. Gotcha, He would yeah. just kind of, like, wander around at night and, like, report things to the police if he saw them. So it was, it was yeah, more of, like, a security. Yeah. Um, but he, like, dressed up in an actual uniform and... Yeah, it was it was kind of cool. I think he moved somewhere. Um, I remember seeing him on the news. Oh yeah. Uh, and there's like articles written about him. Yeah, it was like it was really cool. It's pretty cool, you know. It's not okay everywhere. Yeah. But you know, yeah. in some places it is. Someone put this animal back in his cell. Is that what the Batman Batman just said that? No. Oh. Oh, hi, Harley Quinn. How do you like my new uniform? Pretty hot, huh? Oh, I got something to show you. One second, Batman. So she used to work at Arkham Asylum, right? She did. She's actually got a PhD, and she's a psychiatrist. I actually really like her character in particular. She's very interesting. Hmm. In case you ain't figured it out, she, uh... Fell to madness because of the Joker. Well, one could say that Batman himself has also fallen into madness. I mean, you know. But not really because of the Joker. Not so much. I mean, it certainly didn't help. Mm -hmm. But yeah, no, he's, he's got more going on than just that. I'm here. Yeah, uh, why don't we go ahead and call this episode here after Batman finishes his thing. Okay. Because uh, it's getting to about that time. I think this is a game we're probably going to play for a while. Uh, probably. Probably. Although it's not super long as far as games go. It's not even half, or uh, I don't even think a quarter as long as, like, Twilight Princess. How, how like, how long compared to, like, Sonic uh, Forces? Okay. <laughs> much much longer most games are much longer than sonic forces <laughs> all right well uh any last words batman <laughs> no thanks for uh thanks for watching guys have have a good one where's the trigger <laughs> I don't remember what my normal like outro is. I should scan. The really? <laughs> yeah. What is my normal outro? It's been such a long time since we've done. What do I usually? It say? hasn't even been that long. What it's do, only been two weeks. What do I usually say? Well, anyway. Well, now I can't remember. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> thanks for watching, guys. Uh, have a good one. It's not that.
I know it's not that. I don't know. I'll have to watch the other episodes and figure it out. I don't know. I can't remember what I usually say. Sigh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs>